What is going on YouTube? It is Primitive here and today I'm going to be bringing you the second quick match for the day. This will be between Security D Brigade, which I'll be playing on the left, versus Shoutmon DX, played on the right by Justin aka Just Digimon TCG. So make sure you go check out his channel as well after this video. But getting on into it, my opponent's going to go ahead and just pass, which shows that this isn't the best hand for him, which is definitely unfortunate. I'm going to go ahead and double play Commandermon here, and my opponent's going to hit the Gaussmon, so it's not over for him yet. Digivolving for the Greymon, which will put me at 1. I'm going to promote, I have 3 Commandermon on board, but now only 2 because I Digivolve into the Tankmon. We do have a bit of glare here, which is unfortunate, but we do know I Digivolve into the Sealsdramon right there. Going, uh, Justin will be at 2 memory now. Hard playing Greymon, so putting some Champions on board, still keeping up not super far behind right now and so i wouldn't be super worried if i were him especially because if i start swinging in he may be able to get some advantage by my cards dying off i play izzy i'm not going to get the memory gain because we do see omnimon which is a white digimon preventing me from getting izzy's effect justin thinking considering the transcendent sword we see but he decides just to play Goonimon, putting me at 3 memory, and I'm going to go ahead and promote Tankmon. I may consider swinging in here soon, but I am going to build up into Andromon, so that way I can consider going into a level 6. I do believe I have one in hand all the way to the left, but I can't see exactly what it is, or if that's a Zwart defeat. But I do just Digivolve into Groomon here, cycling, looking for the level 6. And just developing more on board. All the D-Brigade are Digivolved on top of right now, so I can't get any potential Tank Dramon synergy, but he does play Zeeg, which is where this changes, because I can't handle this, and this just makes it so my opponent now can do a bunch of crazy things with sh potential Shoutmon and clear my board, so the game completely changes. I have Crest Gururu, which I'm going to play now, because I can check the top four. I hit double Dark Dramon, which isn't great, but I do get the Tank Dramon for free, so I guess that's a win in itself. Still at 3 memory. For being at 10 memory, I haven't developed as much, but I am going to swing into security, hit Omni Shout, which is fine because I have D Brigade chilling, or Reboot chilling, so I will just reboot at the beginning of next turn. Memory gauge moved, so we were just making sure it was fixed. Going into Black War Greymon, so I can pressure a lot now. I'm swinging 2 checks, but I do die on the first checks to Omni Shout Mon, so I. My uh, Mega there just dies for free, which is unfortunate, but we still have a Seals Dramon, we still have our Crest Gururu, we have a Command Dramon coming in the back, but most importantly, my opponent's been missing a Rookie, and we do have Izzy in the back, uh, which is making it so we're just never going to be choked. Playing out the Blocker Command Dramon, even though knowing that it's likely going to die by a potential Shoutmon Digivolution effect, but it doesn't really matter because I just have to play around him having it because if he doesn't have it, then I do have the blocker, but we do see the Shoutmon. Digivolve into 4-2. Deciding to put underneath, he chooses a... S Ooh. Decides to choose the Greymon to give security attack plus one. Pops my Commandermon with the Digivolution effect because there is the Z Greymon underneath. Deciding if he wants to attack doesn't have to because it's not blitz, or he doesn't have to decide if he's blitzing, but he's going to swing two checks because of the security. First check is going to hit Greymon, and second check is our Garuru, and second check is also going to hit Garuru. So swing security attack plus two, but I get two Garurumon out. So now I have five attackers out with a potential sixth coming forward with only two security checks. The Goonimon is going to check. I block with the Sealsdramon. Greymon checks, hits Tankmon, which will uh, die there. Greymon can still check, but I have two swings, so he might have to just Transcendent Sword, because we can see that's in hand. He can pop, but if he wanted to, he can't play Omnimon, but I don't see Omnimon saving him here. He's going to have to potentially... I believe Transcendent Sword is going to be the best play, and then hoping that what's in security can save him. Plays Lava Garrido, and then, yeah, so he just scoops there, but we could see that was a pretty interesting game. We're going to go ahead and see what he reveals. That was a security, so it wasn't 
anything there, but I what I was a big fan of that game just because the double Garuru check is pretty funny off of that. It did pretty much end the game there, but I did want to get a couple more videos of the Security D Brigade on the channel just because it was such a fun deck. But with that being said, I will see you tomorrow with the beginning of our store championships uh, coverage. So I hope you enjoy. Peace out.